Bismillah wa salatu wa salamu ala rasulillah. Typical section. What is typical section? Typical section, cross section to make road. Consists of paving liars, wearing a course, base course, and ABC. Some typical have subgrade thickness of paving liars. Maybe use 5 centimeter wearing course, 5 centimeter base course, and 20 centimeter ABC aggregate base course. This typical consists of two carriageways, 3.3 right, 3.3 left, 2% right, and 2% left. Also, shoulder or sidewalk with parking lane, 4.2 right, and 4.2 left, with slope down to the paving layers. Then, start side slope for fill or side slope for cut. We can use this table for side slopes. For heights more than 5 meter, use slope 1 to 4. For fill, 4 to 1. For more than 5 meter, you can use 1 to 5 for cut and 3 to 2 for fill. For the start now, we can use the simple case of cut and fill. With this table for heights and the slopes. Typical consists of heights, slopes, and distances. Starting with distance. What we do to understand the science of distances. If we are going from left to right, its sign will be positive. If we are going from right to left, sign will be negative. For slopes, slope always used this way. Vertical divided by horizontal. Vertical divided by horizontal. If I need to define this slope, 1 to 4, I will divide 4 by 1 equal 4. If I need to define this fill slope 4 to 1, need to divide 1 by 4 equal 0.25. Also here, 1 to 5 must divide 5 by 1 equal 5. Here also, 3 to 2 need to divide 2 by 3 equal 0.66667. Also, for this slope, 2%. That means I'm going down 2 centimeters for each 100 centimeters. How I can define slope sign? Take this rule. Use the right point. Look to the right point of line against the left point. If the right point is down the left point, so sign is negative. If above, sign is positive. Also for side slopes, look to the right point of any line. If down, sign must be negative. Right point here also down, so sign is negative. For this slope, right point is above, so the sign must be positive. Also, height sign. Height sign for section like this. If I need to define heights from this point to this point, if going down, sign must be negative. If going up, sign must be positive. I need to define this point from this point, so going down, so height must be negative. Also, here, I need to go from this point to reach NGL. In this case, height is going down, so sign must be negative. But here, need to define height from here to NGL. So, sign must be positive because I'm going up. What I need to define typical section for Earth's work. I need actually to make this datum to find the differences between this datum line and NGL. This point, this point, this point, this point, this point, this, point. this is my datum line. I need to calculate the quantity between the datum line and NGL. First point and center line here is the BGL point must be negative 1. 
for this and in left side also must named as two points one and two and continue naming points this point must be three this point must be four this point must be five this point must be six this point must be seven this point must be named as eight and nine. So, right and the left points must have two numeric values, but the left only must be one and two. And to continue numbering points from left to right according to my datum line. To read the last point which connect directly to side slope. It's named double numeric value like this 8 and 9. What I need actually is to define this datum to the Earthwork program. Going to XB and start Earthwork program. Select my project, road number 6. And go to design data, typical section. Enter typical section. Press add and give number for this section like 1. And the name for section 15 meter symbol and start defining points from point negative 1 which is BGL point so reference point 0 distance 0 level depth France profile grade here this point negative 1 okay going to point number 5 define point number 5 from point negative 1 so Point number five, reference point negative one. Distance, there is no distance, right or left, so it's a zero. Level difference, point three meter. So going down, put negative point three. Need to define point number four from point number five. Four, reference point five. Distance, going left, three point three. So it must be negative three point three. Level difference. I don't need to use level difference. I will use SE main left. Left sober elevation. SE main left. To define point number three from point number four. Three reference point to four. Distance zero. Height going up. Point three. Defining point number two from point number three. Let's try it. Two from point number three. Distance going left negative 4.2 height no use. I will use sober elevation left outer shoulder and I need to define point number one from two one from two distance zero difference in height zero go to right side six from five point number six from five distance going right three point three 3.3 positive level difference not use use sober elevation main right point number seven from point number six seven from six distance zero height going up point three positive point number eight from point number seven eight from seven distance four point two going right so four point two positive Use sober elevation right outer shoulder. Defining point number nine from point number eight. Also nine from eight zero and zero. Save sober elevation defined before. Also these variables will define the now. Now our section is ready. Make save. Okay. Exit. Design data. Design variables. Check here. 
we have super elevation main right super elevation main left but outer shoulder don't have right or left exit define inter values for left right outer shoulder from station zero to the end slope start from now defining right side so this slope two percent two by one hundred so point oh two the right point is above so it's positive point oh two and here positive point oh two start okay exit defining variables sober elevation left outer shoulder from zero to end now defining left side left side also two percent but the right point is down so it's negative point o2 negative point o2 negative point o2 start okay exit now need to define side slope for this typical number one we define now defining cases of side slope according to this table less than five meter cut slope one to four fair slope four to one so we will use for cut vertical by horizontal we will use four for fill we will use one by four so point two five for less than five meter for more than five meter we will use five for cut and the point six six seven for fill so go to our software we have four cases for side slope side slope cases symbol 15 meter symbol section need two cases for fill left and the right side two cases for cut left and the right side need to define for each one modify first we have design number link number height and the slope what is this values design number is the case we have two cases here less than five meter and more than five meter so this case is case number zero and this case is case number one for each we have cut and the fill right and the left for this simple section we have two cases only each case have one simple link from this point to catch a point or from end of datum to catch a point from end of datum to catch a point I need to put design number for fill right side design number zero I write link number zero automatic if I write again design number zero this link will be number one but we have simple section so only one link for each side and each case for fill right side fill right side like this case we have height or distance we have five five in height for this case for height in fill I am going down so 
This height must be negative. Negative 5. For slope, look to the point of right side, it's down, so it's negative. And from for fill, point to 5. So must write point to 5, negative. Point to 5, negative. This is case number 1, design number 0. Case number 2, it's called number 1 here. Link zero for heights more than five. I can type 1000, I can type 100 according to maximum height expected between design level and the energy level. So use negative 100 and the side slope in case of fail 0.667 and going down. So negative 0.667. Okay, let's go to left side, design number zero, link number zero, height for fill section in right side, so slope, the right point is above the left point, so it must be positive sign, according to the table, this fill, point two five, height according to the table, it's five, five, on the left side and going for fill so it must be down in cases of fill left side height will be down so negative 5 slope in case of left side fill the right point will be above the left point so it's a positive 0 0.25 positive case of fill number 2 link number 0 distance above 5 meter use negative 100 slope for left side more than more than 5 meter we will use positive 0 0.667 0 0.667 save and go to cut case cut for left side we will use this link case number zero less than five meter height in case of cut our slope will be four but height will be five according to this section height going up so it must be positive five and the slope is the right point is lower than the left point so slope is negative I will use design number zero, link number zero, five meter positive height, and I will use negative four for slope. Case number two, for cut more than five meter, I will use five by one equal five as cut slope. Case number one, link number zero, height, more than 5, assume 100, slope, also negative, 5, save, right side, I will use right side, cut, here, I am going up, so height is positive. I am going up, right point is above the left point, also side slope will be positive. So case number zero, link number zero, height, five, slope, four. Design case number one, link zero, Height, use 100, slope, also positive, make 5, save. Once we finish defining these four cases of side slope, we are ready to calculate quantity. Exit. First step, 
go to typical section and select typical section for our station from zero to end I will use my symbol 15 meter press ok that I will save exit next step step number two calculate typical section from zero to end calculate side slopes and calculate road section press start you will start calculating cross sections side slopes and the road sections for each station it's a counting no errors done exit to see my fairest cross sections go to cross section display cross sections zero you see here we have full section as we defined left side super elevation point o2 right side negative point o2 right side slope one two point two five because it's a cut and right side it is cut next section by scrolling mouse both sections are fell fell and the fell one to four one to four next section next section next section next section we have this case also still one to four so we are less than five meter right fail left cut scrolling down to review all stations to find if any mistakes this end and the cross section is going good close this window start the quantity calculation display and the print now you can print quantities reports there are two methods for quantity calculation zero line and average area the most accurate method is average area we have two types of report detail and the summary for detail from station to station from start to end you can print the preview it's counting this is your first section you have road section points and the ground section points let's zoom and the check point number five offset zero and level number four three point three number three three point three and it is above by 13 centimeter also point number two is negative 7.5 and this is catch point number one and number nine current section area total fill 2.7 total cut point to five one eight by negative sign cumulative 
zero zero because this is section number one. Going here, scroll, you will found section twenty five. You have cumulative quantity. Current section and the previous section. This previous section number zero and this is current section at station twenty five. Average area is here. Distance between section is 25. When multiply average area, and this is road section and the ground section. Scroll mouse up, next station. Go up to C section. You have my section. Road number six and description. Down, we have constructor and the consultant like we defined before number four at station 75 we have left side slope and the right side slope one to four one to four because this is failed section also for super elevation we have point o2 and the negative point o2 profile grade and so on to the end of my road. This is detailed cross section. Go to summary and the print preview. We have two pages. Page number one distance, section area, average area, intermediate volume. Accumulative for each station down up to station 800 our cumulative will be 10,729 for fail and negative 163.15 for cut go to page number 2 this is the end of road. Now your quantity is ready to print. Press print. This is my BDF factory bro. I can save as summary BDF dot BDF. Save. Also for cross sections details, I can print my PDF Factory Pro. Save. Details. Dot. PDF. Save. Close, exit, exit, details, and summary. Open details, we'll see my cross sections, review, and the print. Open summary, we'll see my volume table for review and print thank you and see you again